here and today I wanted to show you my pet mantis and I'm also going to be telling you about how you can actually make stuff like this and how you can actually make this whole enclosure. So first I actually found this mantis outside of outside and since I don't live in America I live in India I make every I make this at home. And if you want to feed your mantis, all you can do is that if you live in America or if you're close to any pet stores, you can actually buy crickets and all to feed your mantis. But what I like to do is I like to, you know, just catch them off. There's a garden next to my house and I just catch them from there. And I will be showing you the mantis. So as you can see, I have like this type of area and I actually just cut it off from here since this is useless now. I'm using all the useless stuff. As you can see, the mantis has come out. It is very easy to close it also. So this is my mantis. It's a girl, mostly because it's so big and it and it has wings. Um, I haven't thought of uh, any tricks yet because just yesterday I got it. And by today in the morning, I thought I would finish the house. And the way I, and I caught it pretty easily like this and it was actually having pretty a, a bit fun actually and it likes all these areas i like that how it's got the wings and all and since i don't think there are any places where you can buy mantises in india there's some websites but they are not for india and it's just easy i just caught it like this it started going on top didn't trouble me didn't even do anything so as you can see, this is the mantis on a uh, little bit of close up. Oh wait, it's going on the camera! It's going on to the camera! Oh, come on! Yes, it it's just on the camera, guys. But it's got used to holding. Actually, before I caught it and before I made this, um, I actually had kept it on a leaf on the, on one of my plants, and it was staying there. And then just today I had uh, shifted it. I just used this to get it again and I shifted it and I kept it in here. Um, for some people who are scared of mantises, they are not harmful. They are actually pretty friendly creatures. They might be a bit predatory. You can just feed them whatever you, you can feed them ants and all. Um, usually they don't, they don't, they don't eat ants mostly. They only eat like other stuff like crickets and grasshoppers and that's what i will that's what i'm feeding this guy or oh, i mean girl i'm not so sure what should i name it actually i am not that sure with the naming and i hope to teach it like some few tricks and since this is already a big one i didn't have to raise this pr like that it was pretty good that it's a big one already and I actually find it whenever I go out for walking every night. I go around at 8 and and I actually find mantises actually next to a light. So this mantis, it was pretty easy to catch it. Uh, the only thing I'm scared of is it bites me. But it won't have to be doing that. It's going to sink its teeth in some other, in, in another insect area. So guys, that's it for my video. But before I leave, I just want to show you how you can actually, I just want to show you what you need. So all you're going to need, if you're going to have a container like this, first you're going to need a mantis. And then using the mantis, you just got to take anything and just tape it around. And, huh? Upar. First you're going to need a mantis and then you're going to actually have to keep it inside. And this is actually a box full of like raisins. But I, after removing the raisins, I put, uh, just put some mud in and some sticks so that it'll have like the area where it climbs around everywhere. That's usually what mantis is like, climbing around, searching for stuff. But if you can catch any like small insect, you can actually just, you know, um, keep it inside here and it'll catch whenever it wants to. You cannot actually force feed this thing. And that's it for my video guys. Thank you for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.